All right, so I kind of went through my shell. I got some nice pieces of abalone here that I'm going to be cutting up to fit in here. They look nice. I've got a, a couple tools. I've got the saw, jeweler saw. I've got the uh, my little sanding block, three is blocks that I made. That'll do the inside and outside of the radius. Just neat little things. And that's probably all I really need to get started here, other than a mask. And I might set up a, a vacuum for when I'm cutting this, just to get some of the dust away. But yeah. So we got these all cut out. Kind of show you what I got here. They fit in there nicely. A little piece of abalone. And I got them in, all in the same reflective direction. So that if you look at it, they reflect at the same time. Which is pretty cool. At the same spots. Because if you get any of these backwards or flipped upside down, you can affect, it. you can get um, one that won't shimmer like the rest, and it kind of looks odd. So, but it looks pretty good. Now I'm going to stick some super glue in there and uh, probably let it sit overnight. Right on. Alright, so here we go. I got some thin viscosity. I'm just going to fill this channel up. Super glue. You see it running around the sides already. It's great. Alright, before I go in for the night, I think I'm just going to set something on this. Pounder here. Let's go drink some coffee. Back in the shop. Yeah, it looks dry. I think it's ready to go through a sander and we're going to level it out. That's really good. Cool. We got our rosette all finished up. Abalone shell in there. One more thing done on the guitar. I just want to say thanks everybody for watching and thank you for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit the little red button down there and uh, you get updated on new videos as they come out. And sooner or later, this guitar will be all finished up, and strung up, and we'll be playing it. So we'll see you next video, guys. Thanks.